What's up guys and bolt fans, this is Nick and today I'm going to real quick show you how to test out your sump pump. Now, you might do this just because you haven't heard it go off in a while, you might be leaving for vacation, maybe the snow is melting, there's numerous different reasons why you want to just test this out um, every once in a while just to make sure everything is still working. You can see here that I have, um, so I actually had to replace mine semi-recently, so I'm using a, I picked up a Barracuda Universal float switch. Now obviously you could go ahead and just fill this with water um, to test it run a hose down here or if it actually is raining which it is right now it'll fill up by itself and you can test it that way but I usually like to do though I don't usually obviously I don't test this when it's raining and I can just hear it go off but I always have a kind of clothes hanger sitting down here so I can reach down in and test it with now if you have a wire hanger it works a little bit better unfortunately my wife threw out all of our wire hangers and all we have is these plastic ones now so I had to I just kind of took a couple of zip ties and fashioned one to be able to reach down in there now, normally you would have a cover, most likely, over your sump pump. You can see that cover right there. Mine's a little bit harder to get at just because there is a sink above it, but basically you just go ahead and remove that. Um, dip your clothes hanger down into the uh, sump pump area, and you can kind of hook it on the float switch. Right here is the float switch. If you just lift this up, you can hear it go off. And that's all I do. I'll usually do this before I go on vacation, like I said, stuff like that. Just to make sure everything is working as it uh, as intended so that way I don't have a surprise when I get back or when the snow melts. Uh, thanks for watching. If you have any questions, go ahead and pop it down in the comments and we'll see you in the next one.